<sighs> Luigi, wake up. What? Oh. I guess it's, it's almost opening time. Yep. Okay. Well then, I bet it's probably time for us to get the sale started. And in the meantime, when we take a few breaks, why don't you go hang out with Moose and Tangle? They've got a few new shows for the for you lot. Why did I pay someone to why did I pay someone to bridge to do the work of spin I mean I didn't have lots of people to go to, but yeah, I I I told him this. Daddy! He can make balloons! What? I think she's talking about Circus Mario. I I programmed him to make balloons because he's built with a built-in helium tank for inflating balloons. And he can just buy ice cream, take song requests. Really? Yeah. The high tech, I know, but I wanted this place to be a very huge success. Have you seen him make balloons? Yeah, not really, but... Oh, Daddy, please let me go see him. No, sweetie, you can't go see him. And plus, isn't that area closed off for the day? Uh, no. That area closed off, uh, tomorrow. Due to, uh, maintenance problems and, for some reason, the, the electrical problems, the electrical isn't, the electricity isn't going into that room for some reason, so I have to get someone to check it out. Okay. I mean, you could go hang out with Moose and Tangle, but... You can't see Circus Mario, okay? Okay, I guess I guess that makes sense. You really shouldn't be hard on her now. I mean, she's just a kid, you know. I know, but she always pushes us until she gets what she wants. We have to show her some discipline sometimes. I mean, I understand. I mean, me and Daisy have kids, but we never push them to the limit. I'm like... My brother and her wife. Why would they do? Well, I guess I guess they Well, they ended up pushing their son too far, and he ended up running away. Did he, he came back? They just swore that they would never push their kid to the that far again. Oh. Yeah. Hey, is the puppet working again? Uh, yeah, someone came in this morning and they said that the, one of his puppet strings was accidentally caught on the box, so they just made the untied it. And then I said to cut the edges off the box. So it's a circle now? No, 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 it's still square. I'm talking about the corners for, for the opening, for the, the opening clock parts. Oh, okay, because cause that's what got, because that's where he got caught. Oh, uh, okay. Still, it's almost the end of the week. This place hasn't been filed for anything. Hmm. Honey, I need to talk to you in the kitchen. Alone. You mind, Rudy? No, go ahead. <sighs> Come on, sweetie, it's time to go. Oh, but they're just starting their show. We have a doctor's appointment, come on. Okay. Hmm. Need to talk to you about something. <sighs> okay. Your our work is affecting the family. Well, it's work. It keeps us busy. And plus, making new robots is a great way to start a camp a marketing campaign. Do you know how many toys Spring Rhino has actually sold? Well, not enough to support us, it seems. We had to give Theodore one of your dumb plush toys for his birthday this year because we couldn't afford a proper gift. And you know how much he hates your friend's robots. He's terrified of them! He's not! He's just putting on an act so he can come home and stay in his room all day. Oh, don't turn this against him! I'm not. It's the truth. 
He plays with those plush toys all day. Do you really think he's scared? You know what, Penguin? If you can stop wasting your time and actually focus on the family for once, I will personally shut down your friend's business and move out with the kids. You wouldn't dare. Try me. Huh. Yeah, I guess this place isn't even so scary, you know? I guess. I see you've got that. I see. You, I saw yesterday that you got the Fred, the uh, the Fred news plushie. Yeah. It's not as good as my Freddy Fazbear plushie, but I mean that that plushie has been passed down from generations in my family. Really? Yeah. Hey, Theodore, you want you want to see something cool? No. Oh, come on! I know you do. I promise it's not scary. Okay. Just follow me, okay? Okay. I'm telling you, this place is staff only. Our dad works here. We can do whatever the fuck we want. Why did you bring me into this place? It's kind of creeping me out. Have fun! What? Let me out! Please! How do I fit this thing in the suit? There we go. Sorry, I had to be this way, honey. Locking me in the parts of the service room. Come on, it was very funny. Would you two stop fighting your brothers? Get over it. <sighs> She's right. About being wrong. It was very funny. Would you shut up? <sighs> what is it with you two and arguing? Daddy, where's mommy? Mommy uh, isn't going to be back home for a while. What do you mean? She decided to take a vacation. She got overworked. Oh, okay. Well, why didn't she tell us? She she told me. Uh, okay. I'll go wait in the car. Okay. I hate this place. <sighs> My guess is they are still fighting. Yep. Well, don't worry. Tomorrow's Friday, and then after that, it is over. At least the week, anyway. Wait, are we not working on that? Are, are we not working at weekends? Oh, no, no, we are working on weekends, but our time, our schedules will be, our, our <clears throat> like, our opening schedule, our opening time and closing time is going to be shorter. Oh, okay. Yeah, so Sunday we won't open until 1 p.m., and then we close at 7 p.m., I guess. And then Saturday, 11 a.m. Uh, to... 8 p.m. Oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna go. And I see you, man. See ya. <sighs> Alright, Mario. It's time for my shift. Alright. Hey. Don't worry. The week is almost over. That's what I'm scared of. The government gives us... It's give, only giving us one week... To show that we are a reliable, a reliable diner, and what if we're not? What if something bad happens and then we're forced to shut down? It won't come to that, Luigi. I'll make sure of it. Okay.